What do you think? I mean, talk about defensive players. What well, do we yeah. got? I mean, it all starts with Chins, you know, and Chins is defensive he's coordinator. Uh, Eric Shenander. I mean, he really is. Uh, these guys love him. If they don't love that guy who's leading them, it's going to be tough, man. I'm telling you, it's going to be tough. Like, we love Charlie, do you know? Like, and it was weird in this twisted way, and I guess that's, you know, why we ended up on defensive side, because it's not like he treated us very nice. <laughs> he, he really, really did, didn't. actually, yeah. He, it, it was, you know, super asshole, like the biggest asshole you could imagine. But then he'd, you know, be the guy who's hugging you and telling you how much he loves you, do you know? And, and that's the thing, I think, as, you know, coaches always have got to try to find that that balance there um, because you don't want to be a cupcake right you, you especially now i think you, you got to have you know some energy you got to get after them i mean which is why i i think the best thing that happened this past year was this, the the new guys that that scott brought in you know all of them from mickey to the uh, coach applewhite to to um um coach Raiola and yeah and, and uh you I've, know coach whipple well i've known whip for a long time because he was, when I was at that, that prep school in Connecticut repeating my senior year, he, he was right down the street as the head coach of University of New Haven, so he was always up at our school watching practice. And he'd say, hey, Jay, you want to come down and play for me at New Haven? I said, I don't think so, coach. Higher level, yeah. <laughs>